What's up, fellas? So in the last video I did, someone left a comment saying, hey man, you should definitely do a video showing how you style your Red Wing boots. And I thought, how the heck did I not think of that myself? So today's video is gonna be styling my four current pairs of Red Wing boots. That will be the Iron Ranger, the Mock Toes. I have a Beckman pair and also the Blacksmiths. And I'm gonna show you just a few ways to make, your, to make an outfit look really cool and not look like a construction worker while you wear those killer Red Wing boots. I'm looking at you, Carl. Okay, so let's get right into it. My first boot that we're gonna look at is the Iron Ranger, the classics, the icons, my favorite boot by far. So I dressed this up for in, in three different looks. The first one is gonna be a little bit dressier. And you can see I paired it with these nice skinny gap wool blend trousers. I think they look great. And I got a nice Brooks Brothers shirt on. I gotta get that, that crew neck for a more casual look and just threw that on top of a nice clean white Oxford. I think it's a really nice look. It's casual, it's dressed up, and I think it goes really well with the Iron Rangers. The next one we'll talk about, I went for a little bit more of a rugged vibe. I went for these green, nice, I love this color, this nice army green pair of jeans. Skinny jeans again, because I think it goes with a nice slim silhouette of the Iron Ranger. And I paired it with, I love this, the, that purple Brooks Brothers shirt, I love that shirt. Um, it has green in it, it has a lot of different tones in it, and I threw a nice shawl cardigan. Um, sweater on top, you guys should know, it's, it's such a great way to just elevate an outfit is to throw a nice shawl collar, collar cardigan over the top and I paired it with this nice Red Wing Boots Timex collab, if you guys haven't seen it, I did a video on it, so paired it with that awesome watch too. And the last one I paired with the Iron Rangers, the most iconic look for me is that awesome lumberjack red flannel, looks killer. The next boot we'll look at is the Blacksmiths in Copper Rough and Tough. So I went for a, night, a nice light wash jean. I went with the Levi's 511 for a nice slim look um, and goes great with the light tone of the blacksmith boots. And I threw on a nice pink shirt. This one's from Under 510. Um, it fits great and it's wonderfully smooth, but you can see it's a nice twill fabric. So it's casual, but it's also, again, a little bit more refined. That's what I'm going for here with these looks. And by the way, I know the guys from Under 510. They make some awesome stuff. If you're Under 510, definitely take a look at them. I'll put a link in the description. And since it's still the winter, a great way to just warm up and also look a little bit more refined is just throw a nice gray sweater on top. It'll keep you cozy and also looks nice and dapper. All right, let's get to the mock toes. Everyone loves the mock toes these days. So this is a chunkier boot, so I paired it with a chunkier look. I went with these LSG straight fit jeans, salvage jeans. Definitely a little bit more rugged, a little more chunky to go with those boots. And I went with a nice Henley, again, a, a chunkier Henley from Banana, and I threw a vest on top. So I think that's also a really nice rugged look. And check out the watch. The watch is a, a, a dive watch from Boulder. Love this watch like crazy. I get a lot of compliments on it. And so finally, the last boot we'll look at is these. These are actually a very rare boot. It's the... Beckman Klondike leather flat toe boots. These are great. And I paired them with black chinos. I'm going for like a nice monochromatic look a little bit with a nice cable knit, chunky knit um, sweater. This one's from Slate and Stone, but it's really nice again for those colder days. Check out the watch also. I love, this is my favorite watch. I get a lot of compliments on this one also. It's uh, a nice to sew gray watch and I paired it with this beautiful Harris Tweed strap from Vario. I love these straps. Okay guys, so there you have it. Those are just a few of the ways that I style my Red Wing boots. I think I did a pretty good job of keeping it not too crazy, not too clunky with your boots, but still looking nice, rugged, and masculine. Let me know in the comments, did you guys like what I did? Do you style them differently? Let me know, and as always, like and subscribe. I really appreciate it, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one.